ready? Hello, Way fam, and welcome to Helsinki, Finland. I'm Ashley, and this is Josh. Welcome to our channel. We sold everything to travel the world, and now we want to share with you the way away. So subscribe to our channel down below for more adventures. Let's go. We are using our Helsinki cards to get around Helsinki today. We are going to Sumenlina. Mm -hmm. They kind of say it as they sing. I'm not sure if I did it right, but Sumenlina. I tried. Yeah. <laughs> We're taking the a boat with our Helsinki card, and it is only about five or 15 minutes, I guess. So, oh, it should be really cool. I'm excited. It's like an old sea port. Okay, so we're trying to figure out the Helsinki card. Ashley's sticking it to a screen. <laughs> <laughs> we're not sure if we're supposed to get tickets or if that works as the ticket to, to take the ferry over. Even more expensive. I guess we just try it on the scanner to get on the ferry. Um, so do you have the card? No idea. I, I pressed that, who knows? Maybe. It did a bleep. Yeah? It bleeped. <laughs> and it gave a check. All right. Okay. All right. Just walk right through. I guess it works. So just off the coast of Finland, just near Helsinki, is Sumenlina, this island that people live on it. There's a prison here, there's a castle here, and that's actually not that strange, even though it may sound like that, because Finland is home to the world's largest archipelago. They have almost 180,000 islands in Finland. That's nuts. In fact, there's so many islands here that there's a sea here named the Archipelago Sea. That's pretty cool. I was gonna ask you, actually, I was gonna pop quiz you what an ar archipelago is. It's a group of islands. That's there you all? Go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure an archipelago is just a large grouping of islands. That's such a fancy word for something Archipelago. Like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's go explore this part of the archipelago. Ready, got a map. here right now. It's almost like a town that's been stopped in time, um, except people still live here. <laughs> and it's so big that because even though there are people here walking around, we almost feel alone. Anna, who we're staying with, she actually has friends who live on this island and she said they love it. To me, it seems like you would be living in, in like a state park. I don't know if anything will be open, like uh, museum-wise, because we're here a little later in the afternoon, but I bet the sunset here will be gorgeous. of Sumenlina was added to UNESCO World Heritage Sites in 1991 and we're about to go in the gate. Sumenlina was created by the Swedes when they actually ruled over this land and then it was overtaken by the Russians who also had it for a while, I think like a hundred years, and created it more as a military base. <laughs> but currently, Finland is Finland, so they own it, and um, it's just mostly a museum now. Wow, this is beautiful. Something that I've noticed that makes it really unique are the rocks around the edges of the island. I really like that. It gives it such a, I don't know, the look is just totally different. I really like it. I can honestly say that's a new one on me. I've seen people parasailing before, but never on the ocean just up against a little wall of grass where the air kicks up a little bit. He's just sitting there. He's not even trying. He's just like floating, hovering. He saw me with the camera and he came over. 
That's pretty cool. This place, I don't know if I've seen anything more gorgeous. I can't believe how beautiful it is here. The huge ferry boat just went past. It's just sunny right now and gorgeous. And really, there's no one around. It's so pretty. And we're taking so many Instagram shots. So look at our Instagram and subscribe to us because um, Josh was like modeling it up recently. <laughs> Ashley was just telling me what to do. I don't know what was happening. <laughs> I know, you probably haven't even seen the photos yet. No. They're pretty good. Okay. <laughs> So cool. It, honestly, it feels like a mixture in my mind <laughs> of Iceland and Scotland combined. It does kind of feel like Scotland in a way, but I feel like it's like um, Scotland's a lot more like uh, they have rules and stuff. Here, you can just do pretty much anything. Well, I mean, no, th I mean, you don't even pay to come here. That's true. In the ferry, there's no payment to get on to the island. And I like how you were coming to explore here and you found a dead end. I know, I'm sad about it, but <laughs> it does go to the other side. But there's another dead end. I can't see over the edge though. Uh, stretch. I got it. I got you, hon. <laughs> there we go. All right. Look, put it down here at my eye level to see what I see. Yeah, here you go. <laughs> nope, down further. Oh, oh, oh. So, actually, <laughs> eye, eye level. level. And camera eye level. <laughs> There's a boat. I can't even see the boat. <laughs> You're so <laughs> cute and short. That, that's enough, yeah. <laughs> You're not in your adventurous outfit. My ba yeah, my ballerina shoes need to be taken care of. We were upset. Actually, I was really upset that we were coming out so late. Josh keeps saying, the light is so perfect. It's so nice right now. So I guess in the evenings, it is better for the light for you guys to watch the video. It's just, no, it's just gorgeous looking, yeah. period, is what it is. Well, either way, the light is really nice right now. Oh my gosh! We found little stairs and it led to this tunnel and we just went through a whole big tunnel. It just kept going and going. I stepped in a big puddle in my ballerina shoes accidentally. My, my phone had said, but maybe there are more of these tunnels. That is so cool. We're the only ones here and we're exploring little tunnels. I love it. And the ferry doesn't stop until 2 a.m. so we could be here all night. <laughs> exploring all the tunnels. This place is magical! Okay, so first, we are pretty much at a fortress, which is, you know, in, in my words, like a castle. Fortress is not a castle because they do like army things and stuff here, which I think it was maybe navy because it's water, but it doesn't matter. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't speak English, I'm so sorry that I was speaking so fast. But there are so many magical things here. Hot air balloons above this island right now at sunset. And there are people sailing, there's people on watercraft, there's a guy on a parasail as well. People just walking around, exploring and enjoying themselves in the sunshine. Barely any wind, look at my hair. I mean, we're on the other side, I think there's wind on the other side. This is the leeward we're side. We're at a King's Gate and there aren't thousands of tourists here. Yeah, I would recommend spending an afternoon here. Huh? Driving this little boat around all these beautiful green and rocky islands. This is so perfect. <laughs> I would come back and I want to stay on like a Airbnb on an island. Probably went on that island or on this island. Even, yeah, yeah, most likely. Yeah, for sure. But I need money for that. Patreon! <laughs> <laughs> Josh 
Josh and I are really enjoying ourselves here. It is beautiful and the sun is going down right now. It's so pretty. But I just wanted to tell you guys, fall is coming. Fall is here. Look it. And I was at Starbucks the other day and I got some kind of folly drink. That is really exciting. We're wearing scarves and jackets. We missed fall last year because of where we were at in Europe. This year, I'm fully embracing it. So be ready for pumpkin spice lattes, maybe some pumpkin soup and some stews. Josh can't wait. Bread and butter. That's Bread and damn. butter. <laughs> we can't wait. I really want to find pumpkins. We're going to be in Amsterdam soon, and I want to find pumpkins, and we're going to have a puppy. We haven't told you guys that, but we're puppy sitting, and I cannot wait because I'm going to walk him in the fall season. It's going to be Josh is taking the dog to go poop. That's his job. <laughs> down. We didn't talk much here because it's just so beautiful. We were enjoying all the scenery. You guys probably saw a ton of beautiful shots. <laughs> but we're gonna head back to the mainland now because we are getting very hungry and we need to get some dinner in our stomachs. came and returned to the scene of the crime. <laughs> Yesterday on our food tour, we were taken to Stockman and shown all the cool stuff here. And if you go on the tour, she gives you a 10% coupon to use at Stockman. Now, yeah. only 5% applies to food, but we still saved, you know, a euro or something. <laughs> we decided to check out the deli and we got some food here. They have tables, free water. Mm -hmm. Yeah, decided to check it out. We got some meatballs. Pad Thai, that's not very um, Finnish. And some uh, stuffed cabbage with um, mushrooms because all the meat ones are gone. Yum. When you come to a grocery store or a deli at nighttime, they're usually out of things. This looks delicious. It ended up being about 13 euro to yeah. get all this stuff. Yeah, but when we were looking at restaurants, it seemed to be much more than that. So this was a good price. <sighs> Verdict is, it was good. Good. Picked up some pastries for breakfast tomorrow morning and a little snack for right now. We're on the train, we used our Helsinki card again, and we'll use it tomorrow morning. We have some really fun things planned for tomorrow, so stay tuned, watch our videos, put a little like down there for us, and I hope we encourage you to get out and travel today. Finland is growing on us. Big time. Yeah, we are loving it and want to come in the winter time, so stick around. We'll talk to you later. See you in the next video. What is the word again for goodbye? Uh, it's like two words to hey, do. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Is yeah, it hey, it's hey, hey. Hey, hey. It's confusing because we, hey is It hello. is really confusing. Yeah. Hey, hey, guys.